$500,000. That's the bond set for a 16-year-old girl from Currituck County. She's charged with killing her baby. Rebecca Blackmore told police she left the infant in a closet after giving birth. Here's 10 on your side's Ava Hurdle. It was at Chesapeake General Hospital where 16-year-old Rebecca Blackmore sought treatment after giving birth and also where she told police she left a newborn baby in a closet and stabbed the child to death. This in her Knott's Island home. Jessica McFarlane is a mother of three children and is left to wonder why. She didn't have enough people in her life that could counsel her and show her the right way she could do things. There again, it makes me wonder where the school teachers were and the guidance counselors were and her parents and things like that that led this girl to think her only option was to stab her baby. One option is North Carolina's safe surrender law, but another resident, Ariel Manson, wonders if she was afraid. I mean, I heard it was like a secret, but um, I don't, like I said, I don't know if her parents knew or not, but being at 16 years old, like being pregnant, I'd be scared. But Chris Wilson wonders what could have been. Just, it breaks my heart, really. Uh, people like me and my wife, we've, we've lost three children and we can't have any more, and I just wish she would have offered it up for adoption for people like my wife and I because there's, there's plenty of families out there that would love to have a child. The teen remains held here at the detention center on $500,000 bond. She was appointed a public defender to represent her. In Currituck County, Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side. Now here's some of the legal ramifications at 16 under North Carolina law. We're told that Blackmore is being tried as an adult. Her attorney advised her not to interview at this time.